All right, time for another math easy solution. We're discuss uh, general laws of exponents and look at the proof for this one: a to the power of x plus y equals to ax times ay. Basically, this will be uh, the first law in this video series. Where I'll cover these four in later videos. Basically, if x and y are are real numbers and a is greater than zero, then a a uh, x plus a to the power of x plus y is equal to ax times ay. If it's but if it's a minus sign, you divide instead of multiply. And if there's a bracket here, ax, and then there's a y on the outside, it's the same thing as writing a to the power of x y. But if you have a b to the power of x, that's the same thing as writing ax times bx. And I'll prove all these in later videos. Today I'll prove this one right here. Before I get to the proof, I'll also recall from my previous videos on um, laws of exponents using the exponential function. This one is in general that I'll go over, which is base a. And then uh, when using base e, I proved that e to the power of x plus y is ex times ey, same as all, all these ones. These are basically the first three, but with the base e, and I proved all these in the video links below, so make sure to watch that. And, and basically, uh, yeah, so and also before I get to the proof, I'll also recall this definition, which I went over in my last video on general exponential functions, which is a to the x equals to e to the power of x ln a right here. So now let's go ahead and prove it. So yeah, now we'll prove that a to the power of x plus y yeah, equals a to the x times a to the y. And we'll go, th uh, basically to prove this, we'll first use this definition, uh, which I covered in my last video. Make sure to watch and understand why I define it like this. Basically, if we use this definition, we'll, we can write a to, the power, a to the power of x plus y and just replaces x, these ones here, with x plus y. So we'll have e to the x plus y right here. And then brackets times it by ln a right here. And now this part right here equals to basically e to the power of x, um, yeah, x ln a if we multiply the ln a inside. Ln a and then plus y, and then this is going to be ln a right here. Yeah, so ln a right over here. And now what we could do is use the, the last law, which uh, I showed in my last video, basically in my earlier video, this one right here on um, law of exponents with exponential function as a base. e to the x plus y equals ex times ey. So we could just write that down. This is going to be now e to the power of x ln a times it by e to the y ln a right here. So this is an x right here. And now this is, um, so now basically when we have this right, right here, now we could basically use a definition again. So ax equals ex ln a, and this is ex ln a, so then this equals to ax. This is ey ln a, so that's just gonna be equal to ay right here. And again, we'll have it, just write this back down here. So a to the power of x plus y equals to ax times a to the power of y. So anyways, that's all for today. Hopefully you'll learn from this uh, quick proof. Uh, like always, you can download these exact notes in the links below in the description below. And also uh, stay tuned for later videos and I'll prove all of these ones as well. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for another math easy solution.